Okay, so today I'm going to summon for SSB. Um, <clears throat> I don't need her, I already have her. I think uh, if most of you have already seen um, a lot of my other videos, you know I have her already. Um, but she's S imprinted. And I don't have her artifact maxed. Um, this is where she is now. I'm probably just gonna pull until I go to pity. Hopefully, I don't have to go to pity, and then I pull one and maybe go a little further. Um, I'll just kind of feel it out as I go. Um, but I, I'm pulling at least until I get one, because then sh I'll imprint her to double S. Um, and I also need the the Rangars. I have um, two limit broken. I have three bottles, right? And then there's the fourth bottle in the shop right now. Uh, I can max it out, you know, right now if I wanted to, but. Um, I'd rather just save the bottles and like seeing as she's here or she's back already I might as well just pull uh, bottles there. Um, I guess as long as I'm here already, uh, this is kind of the build I'm running her on right now. Uh, 47. The defense is a little low, she does take a little bit of damage. Um, and then you know, the um, HP is a little low too. I liked her at around 14-15 with a thousand defense but uh, yeah I don't know, I'll have to figure that out. I think. So these are 88 gear already. I can't I can't uh, boost this, but I can boost this. Now is this gonna give me the HP boost I want? Probably not. Um, I think I'll get like 5% out of here, uh, which might, if I'm lucky, puts me up to 1400, and then obviously max limit break in this gives me a little bit of extra health here. So both of those combined, hopefully I can get up to 1400, and I think I'll be satisfied there. Um, I dropped a lot of her crit damage just for more attack because um, the Rangar is going to benefit more off of that. Uh, just a little more speed and a little more, just just a little more survivability. Um, yeah, so that, that's what that's just, that's just she's running now. Uh, so let's yeah, like I said, let's just go. Actually, maybe I should see. Uh, let's go back again. I probably should have done this beforehand, but how many do I have in here? Is it full? Well, I don't know, it takes long. 299, nah, that's fine. I'll just like summon anyway. Um, yeah, so I only have 283. I was grinding up some bookmarks before this um, out of the secret shop. But uh, I started running low on gold. I spent like 5 million gold. And I'm down to like 20 million right now. Uh, I don't like being so low. On gold, just because you know you kind of need it for here and there. Uh, so I just you know I just stopped. Uh, the rest of the bookmarks I'll get them from uh, from packs if I need to. Gotcha. I, I do still need eject. Uh, so that's another reason to summon is just getting stuff that I need. Uh, Tiaria, it'd be nice to just imprint her little uh, ML version that they gave us. Uh, Alexa, uh, either eject or a uh, Cartusia would be good. Uh, so far, I've gotten twenty summons in, and I haven't gotten anything. Uh, let's see. Let's take a look at this. Yeah, hopefully, I mean, I want to get two because I'm greedy, but um, I guess just one would be wouldn't be too bad either. Now, uh, what are we getting? Potion vial. So we're twenty summons in. Oh, twenty summon. Let's see what this is. Oh, is it her already? There's no way. Oh, I was about to say. Uh, again, Cartusia would be nice. Or Zerato imprints are pretty good too. Um, they've only gotten two shinies. It's not the worst, but could be better. Uh, I don't have enough to pity. Um, ML Violet. Um, I have like 5,000 Mystic Metals. 
I'm probably just gonna wait till the last uh Corinne, cool. I need more Corinne imprints. Probably just gonna wait till the last week to see who comes after him. Uh, a lot of people seem to think it's a Vildred. Uh, knowing my luck, it probably won't be. Um, but yeah, I'd also like to see not only who's next with ML Violet, um, who's after ML Violet, I also want to see um, who's with that new one, because we're going to get a new four star. Um, you usually, I mean, you're not going to pull. It, it just depends, right? Like, usually you want to focus on on the uh, five stars, but if you're getting a Vildred with a new four star, that's not too bad either. Uh, let's see what I got here. Aureus. 23. So I had about halfway, so we're getting close to like 60 or 70. I have to go get some more. Oh my gosh. You always get units when you don't want them. Uh, Tiaria merges, always good. Okay, here's another one. Any one of these golds could be uh, Rengars. Oh, yes, cool. I think, hopefully, please be a Rengars. Ah, <laughs> I got an idol's cheer. I actually spent uh, powder when this was in the shop, I think recently. Uh, so that's, that's pretty irritating. Um, well, let's just keep going. I mean, it's not like I'm going to stop. See if I get another five star back to or why not back to back, but like just one off. Oh come on. Ah uh, let's see. Dust Devil. I think it's interesting I was just thinking Dust Devil was pretty good on Kron, but I I think what's more interesting to me is just how many artifacts are good on Kron. Like Kron works well with almost every Assassin artifact we have. He works good on Alexa's. He works good on Dust Devil. He works good on uh, RNL only because he works good on Dust Devil. Uh, but Dust Devil is usually better just because it's a higher percentage chance of happening. There's some units that uh, benefit more from RNL taking that second turn because they have more skills. But since Kron only has his is S3 and his basic attack, it's really not that big a difference whether um, you take a whole other turn or you just basic attack again. So I'd say uh, Dust Devil's pretty good on him too. Uh, what else is good on him? Like Elia's Knife, uh, what else? I already said Alexa's. Dream Blade is good on him. Is this her? No. Uh, Dream Blade's good on him. Yeah, I mean, most uh, a lot of artifacts are pretty good on him, which I just find that kind of weird. Like, there's not a whole lot of people who could benefit from so many different artifacts. And, you know, like, you take someone like, um, like, Vildred, and sure, he'll benefit from, like, a Dust Devil, he'll benefit from all these things. Um, th but I, I feel like people don't benefit as much as he does, because if he gets Alexa's and he gets the greater attack, like, he has a built-in attack boost, which means that he'll just, like, carry that over. It'll multiply it times, uh, whatever. Oh, finally eject. Okay, so I gotta go grind him up and get his friendship. Um, but he doesn't come with an attack buff, so he can't, like, multiply it. You have to come, you have to bring someone else with him. Uh, which usually a lot of teams you'll find on, uh... Oh, cool, see? This is always, this always irritated me. Like, I had to go out and go, because if you press this, it'll do that, but I guess we have this now, so it's pretty cool. Here in this window are the same as sold in the shop, yeah. Uh, I can buy 16. I think... This is an interesting, um... Time to be doing this, because... If you guys all watch, uh... Shotgun Shogun, and I kind of agree with him, um... There's still a chance that there could be a new limited... Um, water seasonal unit, whatever. Um, coming after Bologna, that's that's different. Um, I don't know if they were that sadistic that they'd go like two limited units back to back, uh, bait everybody with uh, the Bologna and then bring somebody. But I think you would do yourself a favor by just keeping that in mind, um, making sure you have resources because I, I imagine a lot of people. 
Some people, oh, there she is. Some people who missed her the first time uh, are probably going to go all in this time. Um, like, you know, triple S imprint and all that stuff. Um, and then it'd be funny if they just sort of all got baited and then, you know, there's another one next, another, you know, meta changing unit for the next year and people don't have enough for that next time. So, yeah, if you're watching this and you don't already, uh, aren't already thinking that way, I, I, I would certainly, um, keep that in mind going forward is that there could be something coming after her um, so I already pulled her I don't really feel like pulling some more um, I want to save my crystal we have until the 8th which is what next week so I think I'm just gonna wait play things by ear wait out a little more uh, see how many bookmarks I get here and there uh, if I can and then you know the, the weekly uh, arena reset and all that stuff so if I think if I think uh, I have enough to pull on her again to reach pity, which hopefully I, I didn't reach pity this time, but the second time I'm fairly certain I will. I might pull on her some more, and I won't burn the the bottle. I won't burn the bottles just yet. Um, but yeah, we'll see how that goes. So, so I got five thousand here, and I got a literal two hundred to go. So I think the the pity is eight thousand bookmarks. So I'm not gonna buy any. You're not gonna see me buying any uh, mystic packs just because it's not really worth my time or money. But, um, yeah, I mean, this is a good, let's see, so we have this and we have this. Uh, this one's not that good just because this isn't very useful yet. I mean, might be more useful later, but as of now, it's not, like, the best. We got, uh, her here. I just need more imprints of her. Imprints of her are always useful. I mean, she's essentially useless. Um, all these are, aren't very good. I already have, like, two max limit broken these. Cartouches can be good for ML Cartouche. Uh, while Charlotte is better than she was before, there are still better f other five stars. Like, at the at, like, yeah, like she's better, sure. Just you know, she's still not very good. She's not something that like is gonna go in and just like dumpster everybody. Um, she's still, I mean, especially now that SSB came back, like SSB just hard counters her because not only does she take less damage from her, but she's just feeding her free like you know counter stacks the whole time. Um, but yeah, so this rotation isn't too good. Uh, if you're gonna pull, this rotation looks pretty good to me. Uh, CDOM imprints are always good. Uh, SID imprints are always good. These two are kind of give or take. Um, bottles, if you need them. Imprints, you know, for newer players, I guess this is pretty good. Uh, this stuff is kind of useless. This artifact needs to get boosted or something because it's, it's not very good. Um, no one benefits from speed and attack with, with such low HP. Like, it just... The point where this is useful is the point where they're about to die. Like, no one lives that long at that uh, low HP. Um, so, yeah. Uh, Violet, obviously, he looks pretty good. Uh, I've seen a few damage test videos, and he does about as much damage as I thought he would. Uh, so, yeah, I mean, I think he's good. I would like to pull on him, but again... Uh, Luck favors the prepared and the cautious. So again, always just keep in mind, don't don't like get yourself taken in by the hype and then burn them all and then something else happens later. Because, um, I mean, for, for right now, because I don't know what's next and it people are, you know, people have been saying it's going to be A. Vildred next. The, the choice comes down to, is he better than A. Vildred? And that's the question you need to ask yourself and I'm sort of asking myself as well. Uh, do I think he's better than A. Vildred? It's hard to say, um, which is why I'm so hesitant. Like, even if A. Vildred is confirmed for the next one, I'm still going to have to really think hard whether I want uh, Violet or, or Vildred in that situation. But, um, yeah, the, the fact that, like, I'm, like, that that hypothetical comes up and the choice is still difficult to, to come up with um, kind of says a lot about Remnant Violet. He's not, like, um, you know... He's not just like some guy they just threw in here. He's actually something you want to really consider. Um, but yeah. Let's see. Uh, Crimson Armin. I don't have a Crimson Armin, and it would be nice to pull her from this. So, or it might be nice to pull her from here. So let's go. Let's just burn this. I had those uh, Mystic Metals up there, uh, or uh, Gold Transmits, and we sort of leave him. Um, I made that video where I did a bunch. Uh, like I said, don't really see a whole lot of reason to save them anymore. Uh, I was just kind of saving them just because I wasn't interested enough. Right now, it's like... 
Uh, what the hell is this? I don't care. Let's go back to summoning. So let's just pull it. See if I get anything. Come on. Oh, I didn't get anything. Um, Otoli. Have a bunch of you. I think I have enough to four star her with her own copy, so that's pretty cool. Uh, do I have anything here to summon? No. Uh, Lilibet. I already have Lilibet. And I have like three copies of Lilibet that I didn't even. I, I pulled one from here, and I just pulled like two more randomly uh, in time, which is pretty weird. Uh, Zerato. So I'm gonna have to go clean out the barracks, but yeah, that's about it. Um, like I said, uh, I'm so I was summoning because I already have her and, and I'd like more imprints, but uh, just be cautious with your resources. Keep in mind there's um, probably more interesting. There might be more interesting stuff coming later. I summoned on her too, but yeah. So just you know, be wary. And oh yeah, I might make like a. If I decide to summon again, I'll probably make a video uh, with those summons. But uh, if not, then, oh well, yeah, this is the last one on, on SSB summons.